Well hello there, this is John. I'm going to make a garden tool for pulling weeds out. So I took an old shovel that I found and I cut most of it off to create a prong. Like a prong here, see? I'm going to put another prong, attach it here on the lever so it goes into the ground and grabs the weed. Let's see how that works. Okay, so what appears to be happening now is we've got that cut out, this guy here we've got this guy cut out here which is going to go on the back apparently I'm not sure if it's going to go that way or not yeah, it's going to go that way, that's right and then it's going to have a hinge on it and this hinge will fit I'm going to weld this to here there so the other end will attach to that and then onto this edge here I'm going to weld this which will give us a little lever to get some purchase on the weed. So now as you can see I've got it all welded together. I've got a hinge there, I modified the design slightly and uh, now I'm going to go out and try it, see if it works, I even found a pole for it, good job. So I tested out the weed puller and it did not work, what happened was the shank broke here, I used a drill bit, not realising I was thinking the whole drill bit was round but it's actually it's round here but that gets really thin so I used the drill bit and when I welded it the welding just burned right through here because it was just a thin drill bit but also the amperage was way too high so I turned it down and I used a full shank this time redid it and also I cut these points shorter because they were too long and all and now it's more like a parrot beak you see beak beak <laughs> there we go so that's that's what's happening there before it was more like a, a stalk beak so i think this will work much better i'm gonna put it together and we'll test it out finally got it made this is it here and as you can see the beak is more parity than stalky so it keeps looking like a bird I put two eyes on the front so now we'll go out and give it a test and see if it works all right so the typical you know if it doesn't work the first time just keep going and eventually I'll figure it out also had a paint in a different colour that probably had a lot to do with it and put more substantial brackets on each side to hold the spindle part here, the axle so this should not break, let's test it out try this There you go, first one. I'll assume you put them somewhat parallel. Right, and then you put your foot there and while pushing down with this part there. There we go. Does it want to work? Then you cross the well. Okay, now I'm gonna pull that out. See when that's that. There we have. 
proof of the pudding, one weed. <laughs> Actually we've got we've got two in one, it's so good you get two in one. Can you believe that? It appears that this axle is working really well. Let's see what happens now. Did we get one? Oh yes we did. <laughs> Who has it said? I love it when a plan comes together. I don't know. But this definitely works. I'm over the moon. Over the moon. Thanks for watching. Catch you on the next one.